Mr. President, I, as some know, fought a little bit for, I was in the minor, minor leagues for a couple of years. And in, as a presiding officer knows, in Nevada, uh, Saturday night in Las Vegas is going to be a stunning athletic event. One of the most significant athletic events actually in the last 50 years. It's a wonderful occasion for Nevada to be hosting that fight between Manny Pacquiao, I should say Congressman Pacquiao, who's a member of the Philippine Congress, and Floyd Mayweather. They'll be battling out for three separate titles. They're fighting at the 147 pound weight class. And for all the people who think that's small, uh, that's the class that we've had some of our great fighters of all time have fought that same weight level. Uh, these are two great athletes. The winner of the match will be crowned as the greatest pound per pound fighter in the world. And um, they will go down as two of the finest fighters ever in, ever in the history of the world. Um, so regardless of who wins, this bout is projected to shatter boxing records for not only it being a significant boxing match, the focus of the world will be on this fight. People all over the world will be watching this fight. They don't really know how many pay-for-view purchases are expected, but I made one last night. I was uh, planning on going to the fight, but as my friend knows, the presiding officer, uh, things have changed over the years. Um, if we want to get one of those good seats, we have to pay for it. And I've been willing to do that in the past, uh, but traffic was a little too heavy there. So I decided to watch it here with some of my family. Uh, but it's, it's glad, I'm so happy that the pay-per-view purchases are expected to exceed more than three million people. And they won't get them any cheaper than I got them, $99.95. So it's wonderful that uh, all previous records will be broken as to revenue. Um, it's, it's uh, the only thing I don't like about it, it's start, the fight doesn't start back here till 9 o'clock, and usually they don't end until around midnight. I wish they would start a little earlier, but as I've learned with my baseball and stuff, they, they just start them later back here. Uh, I'm really excited about this unforgettable fight. There's nothing like a championship fight. There's nothing like one that has all this attention. After I uh, started practicing law, I started judging fights. I was on the Nevada Athletic Commission and I judged fights. I judge lots and lots of fights. And I can remember the first big fight I went to. Oh, it was a big fight. I walked in there and I couldn't, uh, I couldn't imagine there would be that much attention on anything. Of course, there were thousands of people there. I was excited. Um, I was gonna judge one of the preliminary fights. Uh, it was stunning. It was, um, You'll see a ringside, all these glamorous, important people. It's just, it's, it's really, uh, these fights catch the enthusiasm of sports fans all over the world. The eagerness that I have of watching this fight goes far beyond the sport of boxing or the spectacle of a marquee matchup. I'm thrilled for Nevada. This fight will inject hundreds of millions of dollars into the state's economy. <clears throat> It'll benefit Nevadans all. Fighters and their teams, of course, hotels, restaurants, cab drivers, limousine drivers, parking valets, uh, maids, they'll get bigger tips than they usually get. It's gonna be a great time for Nevada. So I've done everything I can within my uh, power here as a member of the legislature to help in any way that I can. And I've interceded on a couple of occasions to help make this fight uh, move forward, and I was very happy to do so.